and welcome back to the channel on this video I'm riding the Blair Graffiti and we're riding right now in some a mix of rain and snow or wet snow temperature is 35 degrees and with a little bit of wind it's making it feel like uh, 27 so that's where we're at here as it's a little bit slick out here I can feel it on my shoes I'm just gonna kind of stick to the main road here as opposed to the bike lane I think definitely looks slick out here this morning I'm out here at about 20 after 5 in the morning on Sunday morning yeah the road still looks a little uh, not great just taking it easy here but on this video I want to talk about a new bike that's out uh, you can uh, pre-order now and I'm going to tell you all about this bike I wanted to turn down here and it's the elect uh, electric expedition it's a brand new uh, cargo bike by Electric. And if you're familiar with the name Electric, or if you aren't familiar with the name, I'll let you know that they have been around since 2019. And they've been putting out several different models now. And basically they're accommodating everybody. Whatever type of bike you need, they're coming out with something to fit your needs. I mean, the most recent one was the trike. But now they have this new electric expedition and it's a cargo bike. And like all other bikes by electric, another budget priced bike. And we'll get to the pricing in just a bit here. But first I want to tell you some specs on the bike. So it's a cargo bike. And this bike, <coughs> Uh, for the prices, you're going to hear the price in a bit, but here's what you get, basically. I'm just going to give over uh, an overview of some of the specs, some of the main specs on the bike. So, it's a 750 watt rear hub motor, geared. As we do a little fishtail there. And, 48, it's a 48 volt single or dual battery setup so you have the option of buying a single uh, or dual and so the single battery is a 14 amp hour so if you buy the dual you'll get two 14 amp hours which will be 28 amp hours and 48 volts and also I can tell you that the controller is a 24 amp controller so the bike has a 750 watt motor and that motor peaks at 1300 watts now that's pretty darn good and it has also 85 newton meters of torque so it's got some torque as well and the bike has a payload capacity of 450 pounds that's a lot of weight so and if you purchase the bike, I think the date, if I'm, uh, I stand to be corrected, but I believe it's the March 24th, <clears throat> they will throw in an accessory package, which will be two seat cushions and two running boards, uh, valued at $149, so not bad. And those are... It sounds like those are uh, easily uh, removable. You can swap them out and all. And uh, so this bike is basically for those who are looking for um, maybe doing grocery shopping, doing uh, 
uh, delivery maybe you're into delivering uh, groceries or, or things different things uh, uh, and you need this kind of bike or maybe you want to cart your kids around um, you can cart a couple of kids on the bike as well as yourself I mean 450 pounds is quite a bit of payload um, and he, the one thing that absolutely surprised me on this bike I couldn't believe it when I was checking the specs on it the weight of the bike so the one battery set up that bike weighs just 68 pounds and with the dual battery even with both uh, two battery setup still only 75 pounds that was amazing to me I couldn't believe that they could make a cargo bike that lightweight whenever I think of cargo bike I'm thinking that bike's gonna be one heavy sucker you know and uh, no it's it that's not bad at all I mean this uh, Lyric Graffiti that I'm on right now is around 80 pounds with the two batteries so it would be actually a few pounds lighter than this bike and this bike is to me the feeling and it is but the feeling of how much less weight this is than uh, the bike that I have been riding a lot the uh, um, the Grizzly almost forgot the name the, the uh, Aerial Rider Grizzly now that bike's over 100 pounds and you can really notice the difference when you get on that one as opposed to these other bikes and so uh, so that bike's got a, a, a light weight surprisingly um, on it but uh, so you get let me go over this one more time oh and I should say a few more things so okay it's got hydraulic disc brakes which are great like I say it's got a 750 watt motor peaking at 1300 watts 85 newton meters of torque uh, it's got the single or dual battery 14 amp or 14 uh, amp hour yes and 48 volts it's got steel fenders I did not mention that steel fenders and then it's also got headlight and tail light I don't I did not see anything on on uh, brake light so I'm not sure about brake light I don't think I'm gonna go down I think I'm just gonna pull a U and go back down here um, and let me see if I can remember anything else oh the seat okay so basically this bike will accommodate a rider anywhere from 4 foot 11 to 6 foot 5 so it pretty much runs the gamut there you know it'll pretty much accommodate just about everybody that uh, you know most most of us are in that 4 foot 11 to 5 or to 6 foot 5 I'm right somewhere in the middle there at 5 foot 9 myself and uh, the seat is adjustable of course and also the handlebars too are adjustable okay let's get to the price so the price of this bike is kind of crazy to me okay so it's $13.99 for the single battery $13.99 and the dual battery is just $300 more I should mention you get a charger with the bike I could not find how many amps the charger is though so I don't know what the amp uh, amps are on the charger I'm, I'm going to assume and I know it's not good to assume we all know what that means but I'm going to assume that it's a 3 amp I stand to be corrected it may very well be something else but that seems to be a pretty standard um, amp uh, for our charger um, that they give you is generally it's three amps some are five on the more expensive more powerful bikes you could get a 10 amp hour or 10 amp uh, um, charger but I, I'm gonna assume that it's a three amp and uh, as somebody rides by me on a bike going right toward me on my side of the road that doesn't make sense but he's looking for trouble there um, 
So for, for if you buy the dual battery though set up on this bike, you don't get two chargers unfortunately. And I looked at the pricing of their charger to buy one, uh, a second one, and it's $49. But I don't know how many amp. Maybe I should have, uh, maybe it was there and I just skipped over it some for some reason. But um, I will leave a link in the description below uh, to take you to the site and you can read the full uh, specs on the bike. It's an aluminum frame. I don't know if I mentioned that. And does have the steel uh fenders which are nice that's what this has on this bike it has the metal fenders but all in all i'll say this electric does have uh bikes for everyone they're coming out with you know several different models now they have got out and they're keeping their prices very uh friendly uh, for a budget uh, anyone on a budget or even if you're not on a budget and you don't want to spend a fortune on a bike um, They're keeping it uh, Pretty good in that way. I mean they're They're about as good as it gets. I can't think of any other company other than when they have sales on that have Their prices as low as electric. I have not tried electric uh, bike before, but I've seen them around in my area here, and uh, they are popular. And uh, but I can't tell you uh, what they're like to ride because I have not ridden one myself. But they seem to do well. They they sell well. I see good reviews on the bike, and. Uh, I think that's a great deal though. Uh, I personally would buy the uh, dual battery uh, for a $300 addition to get another uh, a 14 amps, amp hours. To me, that's a no brainer. I mean, I got the extra battery on this bike here on the Lyric Graffiti and I it's a, it's a 17 and a half amp hour. Um, mind you, it's a 52 volt and it was $500 additional and I uh, never even thought twice about it. I immediately uh, went for the dual battery. Just so that I had that cushion there to be able to go farther should I want to. And gee, for $300, it's a 48 volt, 14 amp hour battery. You couldn't buy, I don't think there's anywhere that you can buy a battery. Um, a 14 amp hour battery, 48 volt for $300. So for me personally, I would just get the extra battery, but hey, even with the one battery setup, $13.99, that's a pretty darn good deal. Let me think now, because I'm thinking, all of this I'm telling you is off the top of my head, so I don't, I want to, Make sure I didn't forget something I wanted to tell you about the bike. I, sh I do uh, remember one thing now. The color. Looks like it only comes in one color and they're calling the color fog gray. So like I say, you might want to uh, go into my descriptions on this video and check out the... Uh, check out the... Uh, uh, link there and it'll give you more descriptions on or uh, more yeah descriptions specs all that on the bike more information um, but I thought I'd get this out and let everyone know that in case you uh, didn't know uh, that there's a new bike this bike uh, will ship I believe it said in April so not too far away I mean if you purchase it now that's not that far to wait now that long to wait uh, good deal uh, If you're looking for a cargo bike want to transport your children or your uh, Maybe just to grocery shop or I mean it's a do-it-all bike you can You can pleasure ride you can shop you can take your kids wherever you want to take them to And um, 
This is a good time of year to buy a bike actually because uh, we're getting into spring weather and by the time you get the bike, spring weather's here, you're ready to ride. So uh, even though I've not tried the bike, I think I think I recommend this bike. I think it's a good bike if you're looking for any kind of cargo bike and you want to buy one on a budget price. I don't think anything would come close to this price. Well, that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you have any comments on this video or any other video, please leave the comments in the comments below. I'll do my best to get to your comment. If you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, please do hit that subscribe button and we thank you. Also, if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit the notification bell and you won't miss a video here on Oregon eBiker Mark channel. If you'd like to purchase a Lyric Graffiti, the bike I'm on, I do have a link in the descriptions for this bike as well as a discount code Oregon eBiker Mark is the discount code that's all one word Oregon eBiker Mark and that will save you $150 on a Lyric Graffiti I'm also on Instagram. If anybody has Instagram or would like to add me to Instagram, I am Oregon eBiker Mark on Instagram. And you could uh, follow me there. So that's going to do it for this video. Once again, thank you for joining me today. And until next time, take care.